hello hope you are doing fine hope you are amazing and hope this message resonates with you if it does please leave a comment leave a share and also some positive energy okay so there is this energy in your past that had very very strong intimate feelings for you and what i am picking on is that this energy is very spiritual but doesn't mean that everyone who is spiritual is on the right path or they are righteous and all that stuff so this energy is very wise it's very intelligent it has a lot of information a lot of knowledge and wisdom this energy is also ascended just as you are but in your past you and this energy weren't on the same level of ascension this energy like i said it knows more it knew a lot of things that you didn't know you could have been even still in your sleep state at that time maybe you could be still in religion or you are still trying to understand what this life is all about and this energy was there at some point to guide you it didn't guide you directly but you learned things from this energy this energy this person they have a lot of information like i say so um you as you you never wanted anything to do with this energy in terms of romance or intimacy you took this person as your sister your brother your your big sister your big brother your elder something like that you gave them respect a mother a father you saw them as a mother figure as a father figure and there is this kind of respect that you you had for them in your heart but then you you realized later on that this person actually wants more than just being in your life as a guide as an angel you realize this person maybe had very strong feelings they could be sexual feelings they could be just intimate but it, it it's something to do with sexual energy that's what i'm picking on so you got to realize maybe they they opened up maybe you started realizing slowly but uh this energy um first of all they wanted you so much to the extent that they never wanted someone else to come into your life and at first you, you didn't notice you or maybe you are not noticing like i said i don't know what timeline that you are on so but i'm gonna go back to yeah you did not notice but then with time you realize that there is something fishy about this person whenever they see you around another gender or whenever they see you around someone you like someone you love there is a way they act this could have even been your friend like your close close friend who you thought we are just friends and this was someone that you looked up to in some things like i said they had some knowledge about some things that you did have so they never wanted to see you with another person with another woman with another man who has come to, into your life to love you to you know and what you didn't know at that time that all the people that you were separating with it's because this person was jealousy and like i said they're spiritual and they know their power okay so most of the time when you are still in your sleep state you are going to find such people on your journey and their main job their main role they are playing in your life in your universe is to put you back into sleep state through love itself so that is the role that this energy that was playing in your life 
so now what happens is after some time you found out that actually this person has no good intentions for you and i feel like at some point um you you separated with this person like you either fell out you forward there is something that happened and you guys fell out but for some reasons the universe brought you back together with this person and uh you thought they had changed you thought you you could open up a little more about your intimate life your relationship life with this person and you did but she did not know that she was tearing up something that <laughs> was going to cause you to fall into someone else's spell the moment you opened up again to this person about how so and so is loving you how you fall in love how oh my god this man is treating you well this woman is dating it whatever this energy got so angry on the inside because it wants you for them this energy has a lot of feelings for you there is a lot of love from this energy but its love is sick that's what i'm getting from my mind because this person is sick in the head they are so obsessed with you you know obsession is also like an illness they are extremely obsessed with you so this is not good for your health especially the spiritual health and you know it that's why no matter how much this person was obsessed no matter whatever you did not give in to this person so when you opened up thinking oh maybe because what i'm getting is this person is also in a situation ship or a relationship or a connection they could even be married they could be having something going on and is serious but they still want you and they even open up and tell you i want you i know i am i am in this marriage but it's you i want i know i am it's but it's you i want that is the energy that i am picking on so after they opened up i'm getting it was one evening where you reconnected where you reunited with this person when you left that place this person cried a lot they cried they cried and they were heartbroken but because like i say they are an alchemist they know how to transmute energy they are into dark magic a lot i'm seeing like a symbol a circle with a it's like a pentagon i don't know if that symbol is called a pentagon i will find out what it is called i'm gonna write it under this but it's, it looks like a star but there are so many stars and then they're in a circle and uh, i'm seeing like numbers um so this person is very good with dark magic they know how to tap into the they know how to use the symbols and also the numbers to transmute energy that is how much powerful they are and then also um i'm getting that they used that with also moon magic i'm getting moon magic i feel like they did this under a full moon and uh, the main aim was to cast you to put a spell on you so that you never find love this person said these words you will you will know what it means to lose the love of your life those are the words they said you will know what it means to lose the love of your life you will know what it means it feels like to never be loved back by the person that you love those are the words that they are saying that's what i'm seeing as they are pouring something onto this symbol like i'm tapping into what they were doing at that time so 
they never wanted you to be able to find someone to love you because you rejected them but like i said you did not do this because you hated them but you don't like this person this is not your kind of person it's also something to do with their sexuality okay um i'm not saying i'm against anything but yeah i'm picking on that it's something to do with their sexuality you could not be into what they're into and that is why you did not say yes to their proposal so they cast you and they never want you to find someone to love you they never wanted you to be in that position but currently you have been doing a lot of work and you have been doing a lot of healing you've been healing your inner child and of course you also reach a point and you're like why am i not finding love am i is this this so you decided to take it upon you like let me work on myself so that i can be able to attract the love that i am that is what you've been doing and of course this universe is going to definitely give you what you deserve because if you put in the work to get something you're definitely gonna get it no matter how much witchcraft no matter how much dark magic no matter how much envy jealousy there is in the world or whatever has been done against you the moment you start putting in the work you are definitely going to get exactly what you are you are deserving of so like i said you put in the work and you feel so positive and you've also been getting synchronicities like angel numbers that tell you you are about to meet the love of your life like 15 15 you've been seeing 15 15 you've been seeing 4 4 you've also been seeing number 4 4 44 a lot i'm getting you've been seeing 999 and also 111 and 111 like three times and then 111 111 also 222 so Oh, also zero two zero two i'm also getting that one so you've been getting those numbers that show there is a, a union or a reunion coming in very soon and you've been getting those messages you're about to meet your soulmate your soulmate is near your twin flame is coming into your life and then they've been like pushing you to heal more and you are at this place in life where you you feel healed of course we are always healing but you feel healed you feel good you feel like you are ready to embark on this journey of love you feel stable your your mental um health is stable you are emotionally stable you are <laughs> stable in all ways and even the other things that are not yet so balanced you are working on them you have applied yourself for healing that there is a lot that has changed in your life that even the physical you has changed you look yourself in the mirror and you feel like oh my god i look younger you feel good and yes um right now there is a very big potential uh soul meant chin flame coming in i don't know if i've used the right english but someone is coming in okay <laughs> someone is coming in and this person is going to be of so much support they are going to be someone that is going to be here in this lifetime to guide you onto a lot of things you are going to embark on a journey of change together i'm seeing five 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 also earlier on when i was walking i saw five 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 on a black car so i feel like there is a lot of changes that are going to be happening not just um in your romantic life but the dark magic that this person did because i saw the five 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 on the black car on the crossroads it was i was on a crossroad and it was coming going in the direction that i was coming from this person is dark magic that they did against you has reversed 
it has reversed it has gone back to them in so many ways okay and what they had done what i had forgotten to say is what they had done they had taken they had made sure that the more you don't find people to love you the more they are attracting people to love them and they are so toxic these people are so toxic this energy is so toxic like they've been attracting in love 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 a lot but they've been failing to keep these people because they are toxic and they are still obsessed with you and now that you have changed now that you have gone through the changes you look good and everything they've been watching you through um private they they stalk you i feel like <laughs> okay this one now is crazy what what is coming in i feel like they even sent you people to pretend like they love you so that they can sleep with you oh my god oh my god oh my god oh my god this person has connection to the message that i did this is now just coming in a full download okay this person could have a connection with go and watch the, the video i did where i talked about um these energies knowing each other it's just a recent video i'm forgetting the caption these energies knowing each other and okay i said the one that sleeps with you wins that is the video so now this person is oh my god they are one of these people they could be there is a very big potential that <laughs> this person also tried to send you somebody and this person they sent came into your life and also the person that they had sent you was supposed to sleep with you and then they go back and sleep with them I think I'm going to have to do a particular video for this cuz I'm getting so much downloads for this particular message and I feel like I need to separate it. So this energy failed to get you through this person that they had sent and also the curse has reversed because you put in the work and you called judgment you called judgment and also your spirit team has been working day and night so that you can be able to find love because you are love itself you operate in love you don't operate from the lower energies you operate from your higher self and if there is anyone that is deserving of love that is you because you you are kind you are real you are honest you are an amazing soul so get ready to find out some things about this energy i feel like you know usually i tell spirit please let them get their own downloads like at least visit them in their dreams so that they can get the real message out because sometimes i can only give you what i can see but there is a lot more for you to know so please you are going to get to know a lot more by yourself that is what spirit is telling me about this energy because now it's it's going through a lot of shame i feel like at some point they wanted they told people that uh this person is is like this because i am the one who guided them you see if that if i wasn't the one this person wouldn't have been in that position they wanted they feel like they are of high rank and they feel like you you are supposed to go back and thank them for the person that you have become because like i said they have information they know things so they thought they feel like you you learned from them yet you did the work you <laughs> you did the work my love and spirit gave you this knowledge you worked towards it and you gained it you 
you are given this knowledge everything that you are because you are deserving of it so this person is a narcissist this person is what is this word called manipulative they are very manipulative they know how to manipulate people i feel like they even one time tried to manipulate one of your partners or your partner to sleeping with them or they almost succeeded or they succeeded whatever whoever this message is for they are, they are very manipulative and that is a character that everyone around them knows about them so now their manipulative tactics are wearing out because now they they have watched that okay however much i am going to be lying to these people around me about this person the truth is that this person is who they are they accepted in their heart but they don't want to accept amidst the people they've already talked to you about with and also this cult i feel like this person was paid at this at some point to to continue to destroy you to siphon you but for them they are doing it because they have they are angry about the fact that you rejected them that is what they were that is why they were doing what they were doing to you but then the other people that paid them they were <laughs> they paid them because they were envious and jealousy so there is a lot of things going on with this particular energy that i'm picking on so just know baby you are safe from this energy the curse has been reversed the spell because honestly i've, I've been getting I put a spell on you by Nina Simone every time. Every time I think about love, it comes. I put a spell on you because you're mine. <laughs> so, and when I tap into the energy, this is what I'm getting. So, this person and their spell, they are, I'm, I'm seeing them seated on a table. A table that looks like an altar that is their an altar that is the altar where they they sit and do their magic and they're looking at themselves through water and then there are candles surrounded and they're so ashamed of themselves because they know what they did wasn't good and now they're trying to seek for forgiveness because they know how much karma they are going to be facing um, this time to come, like these weeks, these months. There is a lot of karma that is coming in for them. So they are watching themselves. I'm seeing their hair is messed up. I'm seeing they're pretending to be happy on the outside, but they're not happy. And it's going to hate them. If it's not yet hitting them, it's going to hate them so bad. I'm seeing like a ship on 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 the sea crashing with another ship and like making a very big accident that is what i am seeing so i don't know what that means but that's what i am seeing <laughs> like i said when i'm channeling i see things so if it makes sense to you it could be something to do with this download you tell me okay i am also seeing um a lady with a scarf that is black standing on like a veranda looking up to the moon i'm also seeing children running around and they're like brown children not white children but like brown half cast kind of something like that so yeah i'm also seeing cats so if those things relate to the message and everything that you have received so you could you could tell us right here in the comment section i'm also seeing a red car i'm seeing a red car i'm seeing a key i'm seeing a stone and i'm seeing a tree with a swing so okay i'm seeing swings now like just swings only so if these things resonate with you and this message this is your message and it's your time to 
open your heart and know that um love is coming in because the reason as to why this curse worked on you it's because you were also still operating from a like you were still in that low vibrational energy you i was still kind of in slip stepped and so this person could do anything to you and i've i'm seeing them stealing something from your house so they could have taken like something personal from you and they used it as a souvenir or in in my language we call it in so they used it on their outer to continue to siphon you to continue to always send you magic and also i am getting that they always get to know actually that was playing on my mind when i was sloping back home today like they always get to know when you find someone they always get to know somehow they get to know so this person whenever you find like someone to love you they get to find out that this person has not finally found the love of their life so that is how they continue siphoning you energy from you and because they know the moment you find someone that truly loves you you are going to be even operating more at a very higher frequency and you are going to be unmatched like you see your energy is already unmatched but now it's going to be amplified like more and also they know that the moment you get into that state of being in love you are going to create even more you already creative but you are going to get more creative so they don't want to be the person that is not recognized they want to always take the uploads they want to always be the one that is lifted and praised so they are not ready to see you win so it's your time to <laughs> work on the i am chakra and the root chakra and the heart chakra as well that is what i am getting and of course the solar plexus so that you know that you you do attract your own chest because um i feel like they've been trying to send in energy recently because they now see that you are on the verge of meeting your soulmate or twin flame so they've been sending energy that has blocked your throat chakra you cannot speak the truth you cannot speak you are not speaking you are out of breath when it comes to speaking it's either you are staying away from it there is something about that as well so i hope this message resonated with someone is becoming long i don't know i'm closing my eyes as i'm speaking i don't know how many minutes i've spoken but i hope it resonates with you if it does leave a comment leave a share leave a like and just know i love you and i got you continue to do good because it's the best thing you can do in life and also you can also continue to call judgment on these people like i call judgment on this person you can say their name and uh you call justice upon you and your lineage and your life and all that stuff just just know that uh at the end of the day what is meant to be yours will always be yours no matter when no matter what so you if you want it early enough if you don't want to be like one of those people that gets married at 80 at what um it's time for you to manifest the love of your life and uh know that you are the winner okay you've won baby again and again and again you have won even without you fighting like i said in my other video love wins always and it shall always win so you won again congratulations congratulations on finding the love of your life that is already coming congratulations in advance okay i really love you so much i'm seeing 444 in my mind so take it take good care of yourself and uh, know that uh you are loved okay peace love and light blessings from africa kisses more love peace wow i've opened my eyes and i'm seeing five five on my phone so okay there is really changes happening in your love life peace i love you
all the best congratulations on your wedding bells 